Kuja, can you hear me? I'm coming to get you. You still have time. Forget about me and go. Just shut up and stay where you are. I don't understand you. Okay, here goes nothing. still alive. I guess that was pretty crazy. Hey, are you alright? Sedane. What are you doing here? I thought I told you to go. Wouldn't you do the same for me if you knew I was dying? Never mind. Your comrades were able to escape. Yeah, I knew you had something to do with it. I'm glad they made it. Yeah, well, it's our turn to get moving. I don't deserve to live after all I've, that I've done. I'm useless to this world. No one's useless. You helped us escape, remember? After you guys beat me, I had nothing left. Nothing more to lose. Then I finally realized what it means to live. I guess I was too late. Hey, don't you go dying on me, all right? What you did was wrong. But you gave us all one thing. Hope. We were all created for the wrong reason. But you alone defied our fate. We do not want to forget this. We want your memory to live on forever. To remind us that we're not created for the wrong reason. That our life has meaning. Sometime later...
So this is Alexandria. Pick up the pace, will ya? I don't believe it. Phoebe! Phoebe? <sighs> that bug on the TV screen. What are you talking about? It's me, Puck. How can you forget me? Puck? You know Puck? The Prince of Bermistia? Oh, come on. What's, go what's wrong with you? If you're not Phoebe, then who are you? I'm... Phoebe's son! Ah, look at all the Phoebe's! I always talked about you, Sedane. How you were a very special person to us. Because you taught us all how important life is. Freya, you're leaving soon, are you not? Yes, I can hardly wait to see everyone. Alexandria, I went there many years ago. How long will it take to rebuild Bermesia? I don't care as long as I'm with you. I love you, Freya. Yeah, he still doesn't remember our past. I just want to cherish our time right now. You taught me that life doesn't last forever. That's why we have to help each other and live life to the fullest. It's time to say goodbye to this room. Save the queen. You have served me well. My duty is finished here. Farewell, Alexandria. Even if you say goodbye, you'll always be in our hearts. So I know we're not alone anymore. Why are you going to Alexandria? You're not going? I never said that! H hey, wait! Why I was born. How I wanted to live. Thanks for giving me time to think. Good food made with heart. This is very important when cooking for friends. To keep doing what you set your heart on. It's a very hard thing to do. We were all so courageous. Hurry! Hurry! We gotta get there before the play begins! Haha, <laughs> there's no need to hurry. The theater ship is no match for my new ship. My new Hildegard is the fastest ship ever. Do I have to remind you? You said the same thing about the theater ship. <clears throat> That's what you said, father. Iko, what did you just call me? Darling, she called you father. Father, mother, hurry! So say it again, Iko! 
what to do when I felt lonely. That was the only thing you couldn't teach me. But we need to figure out that the answer for ourselves. Beatrix! Where are you going? Please don't ask. My mind is already set. Wait, listen to me! I, uh... I never wish to lose you again! Steiner. Let's protect the Queen together. I'm so happy I met everyone. I wish we could have gone on more adventures. But, I guess we all have to say goodbye someday. <laughs> alright, you, all right, you scumbags. Been a long time since we saw Alexandria. Let's give them a show they won't forget. Yeehaw! Break a leg, people. Everyone. Thank you. Farewell. My memories will be part of the sky. The airship will arrive any minute. It's been so long. I can't wait to see everyone. But it'll never be the same. I have to let go of the past. I have to move on, just like he taught me. Ladies and gentlemen, tonight's performance is a story that takes place long, long ago. Our heroine, Princess Cornelia, is torn from her lover, Marcus. She attempts to flee the castle only to be captured by her father, King Leo. Tonight's story begins with Mar when Marcus and Cornelia decide to run away together. And now, your royal majesty, Queen Garnet, Lord Steiner, and... Noble ladies and lords and our rooftop viewers, but I can't read it in time! Marcus? Sweet Marcus, I fear I love thee more than I should. Princess, wilt thou be happy? Marcus, or is such a desire too dear to wish for? After our nuptial, shall I become no more than a puppet? A mindless puppet, never to laugh, never to cry. I wish to live my life under the sky. At times I shall laugh. For no life is more insecure than that. I can't read it fast enough! Cast away thy trappings of royalty, and I shall swallow thee in a gown of pure love. Never again will I part from thee. Pray, my love, make me thy king to keep forever. Ah! God! It's going away so fast. Let us embark on the first ship tomorrow. All my fortunes at thy foot I lay. Uh, see? I no cloud, no squall shall hinder us. Oh, love is sweet joy in the wildest well. All I wish is to be by my sweet Marcus' side. I 
I shall be warring. <laughs> yeah, I can't even keep up with him. I can't even keep up. I'm just... Good day to you, Highness. Good day. With thee of Marcus? Marcus, what news dost thou bring? This. <laughs> the time for our departure is long past. Where is Cornelia? Marcus, the ship soon embarks. Board these. Speak, Marcus. She told me that she would not live without me. So the sun is our enemy too. The eastern sky grows bright. Will we not spread our wings as yonder birds enjoy us flight? Hark, Marcus! They cannot wait any longer. The ship departs! Could she have betrayed me? Nay, Ugh. I must have faith. She shall appear if I only believe. As the sun lends me no ear, I pray instead of the twin round. I beseech thee, wondrous moonlight, grant me my only wish. Bring my beloved Skura to me. Like, most of that, I couldn't keep up with the dialogue. I had to, like, speak super fast. My first ever Final Fantasy game ever beaten. Ever. Oh my god. How did you survive? I didn't have a choice. I had to live. I want to come home to you. So, I sang your song. Our song. Oh my god. Well, anyway, guys, that's gonna be it for the series here. It has been a long while since I began this series, and it's taken me a little while to get back into it, but I'm so glad that I was able to, because now I can put this entire series behind me. And just for the sake of copyright, I'm gonna end this. Ep I'm gonna end this series here. I don't want to play the full song. I don't want to get copyright striked. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed. I'll see you in the next series. Goodbye.